What's up guys, it's Ian Young coming at you from iansjourneys.com and today we're eating a bit of Chinese Chow Cow, some Chinese barbecue tonight. So let's take a drink of beer and let's dive in. Okay, so this is an appetizer if you want to take a look here. This is some yo-yo. This is some dried squid and it looks like they're serving it with a side of uh, soy sauce and wasabi here. So let's go ahead and have a try. Do you eat this with your hands or with chopsticks? Which one? Your hands. Oh, with hands. Okay, so we'll just try it with our hands here. So we'll get a little bit of uh, wasabi in there, oh, a little bit of soy sauce. <laughs> mm. That wasabi's got that really spicy kick, you know, that just kicks up in your nose like that. Um, it's really nice, you know, it's kind of like, uh, like jerky, but in a fish form, you know? And it's not fish, it's squid. That's real nice. Okay, so it's time to try some Chinese Xiao Cao. We've got a number of dishes here, so let's get started. First off, these are some enoki mushrooms, which is uh, pronounced ji jungwu. Is that right? Okay. And uh, here are some enoki mushrooms. These are different than any mushrooms you'd see in America, really, but let's have a try. Mm. Really good, nice and charred. They added a lot of uh, uh, la chow on there. And uh, nice and chewy, but not too chewy. I really like that. Now, this is shanggu. These are like mushrooms that have been barbecued. And uh, I really love mushrooms. I love those shrooms. They help you see life clearly. Mm. These ones are much thicker and hardier than the enoki mushrooms. And overall, I, I prefer these mushrooms over the enoki ones, absolutely for sure. Uh, this is some tofu. Uh, Chinese we say tofu, but in America we know this is tofu, of course. Some barbecue tofu here. Let's see what we got. Soybeans. Mm. Oh yeah. The tofu has kind of um, the jello-y texture, but um, it's fairly firm and uh, I really like it. Nice and spicy. That's very good. Now this one is something I have not tried before. Now how do you say this one, sweetie? Kaishinyu. This is some kind of a fish dish. Huh? Kaishinyu. Uh huh. And this is some kind of a fish dish. And it kind of looks like shrimp here with these little tails on the end of it. But let's go ahead and just have a quick try here. Oh. I don't know if I eat the tail or not. Right, do you eat the tail? Okay. Kind of tastes a little bit like fish jerky. I think this fish was dried before they barbecued it, so the it's kind of tough and chewy like jerky. Very good. Has like a fishy flavor to it, so that's pretty good. All right, and here we've got some spring onions, some greens, and I'm just gonna eat those real quick. I love spring onions. Oh yeah. 
Mm. Those delicious green barbecued vegetables go really great with this kind of fare. Absolutely delicious. We're moving along down the line. That's that plate. Let's move on to this plate. And here is uh, very common. This is jitwe, which is just some chicken. And let's just go ahead and take a bite of that barbecue chicken, barbecue Chinese chicken. I love those charred barbecued bits. Oh, really delicious. And yeah, you know, it's not great for you, but I absolutely love it. And anyone who loves barbecue loves it. It's charred, it's spicy. The meat is nice and tender and juicy. This is like class A chicken right here. Delicious. G2 for you. And this right here is some chicken gristle, which I don't usually eat here. This is. Uh, it's pretty common. I, I'm not a big fan, but you know, let's go ahead and have a try anyway. We're eating some Chinese barbecue. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like chewing through uh, thick pieces of fatty bone in a way. It's not my cup of tea, but it is tasty. Uh, I will give that to you. It is tasty. And here. That's some more chicken. We already tried the chicken, so that's okay. We'll get to that later. And the last dish tonight, some yu. Uh, this is basically fish. This is a mackerel fish, as you can see. And they kind of spread it out and kind of like crucify it on these sticks here. I usually like to add lemon to this to make it really tasty, but you know, that's okay. Let's go ahead and take a bite. <laughs> This is hands down the best barbecue item here. I love the fish here. Um, I really like it because they usually take out the bones here, so there's not a lot of bones, and bones are really common in uh, China. In most fish in China, they always love to add the bones. I can't stand it. But in barbecue, they tend to remove the bones here. This fish is delicious. The skin is nice and crispy. The meat is not dry at all. The fish meat is nice and uh, juicy. And the skin's really crunchy. You can't ask for better. Mm. Some Chinese barbecue for you folks. Really enjoyable, absolutely delicious. Not the healthiest thing for you, but you only live once. This is Ian Young, iansjourneys.com. Subscribe for more Asia, China, and cooking videos, and we'll see you next time.